Hey guys, my name is Simsy. How are you all doing? I'm doing fantastic. Hope you guys have been enjoying the career mode lately. I sure as shit have. But uh, yeah, welcome to the FIFA 16 Queens Park Rangers Road to Glory style career mode. This is season one, episode nine. Now, guys, in today's episode, we have two matches. The first of which is a replay in the quarterfinals of the FA Cup. We've had a lot of replays. We had a replay against. Uh, who was it? Crystal Palace in the round of 16. And now we have a replay against West Brom. We managed to beat Crystal Palace, of course. We also have a match in the championship against Bolton, who are not doing particularly well. I did do a FIFA 15 uh, Road to Glory style Bo Bolton Wanderers career mode, which I really did enjoy. If you guys were subscribed that long, that was quite fun. But we're playing against West Brom here today, hopefully. We can uh, claim the points, and we start off in superb fashion, 1-0 up just before the 12th minute. Charlie Austin, QPR's prodigal son, makes it 1-0. Phillips, running down the wing, gets his shot off. Lindegaard manages to save. Yun Suk Yun, the left back, gets in a pretty dangerous position. Leroy Fier manages to make it 2-0, and we go away to West Brom Stadium. We go to the Midlands and make it 2-0 just before the 32nd minute. Superb, superb stuff. Even though, mind you, we did dominate them in the last game. I think it was 12 shots to 10 on target to their 1-1. Sessegnon scored some fucking bullshit header. You can go back and watch that. Pile of crap. Yuri makes it 3-0 and you're thinking, where the hell is West Brom, we're 3-0 up away, and Bolo looks like he's going to make it 4-0, but they played Lindegaard in goal instead of uh, Fraser Forster, I think it's his first name, Fraser, it might be a different Forster, but uh, yeah, Natum Anua manages to break Hessian's clean sheet just before the 60, or just after the 66th minute, just before the 67th, but yeah, I don't really know what Natum Anua um, was doing there. Fresh bullshit. Ricky Lambert, the former Southampton and Liverpool man, finds Sessegnon and Sessegnon with the header. Deadly. Yuri Tillemans. Back to Charlie Austin. He makes it 4-1. And goal scoring crazy. We managed to beat West Brom 4-1. A well-deserved victory. Seven shots to six on target. And we progress to the semis of the FA Cup. Will we get drawn against Chelsea, Manchester United, or even Newcastle? Only time will tell. Let me know in the comments your predictions. I'm always curious to know your predictions. Who do you think is going to be the top goal scorer of the championship? Will it be Charlie Austin? Will it be Mbolo? Will it be Yuri Tillemans, who's been sitting in the camp? Even Phillips is currently sitting on like 10 goals or something. So it's really um anyone's game. Bolton look like they could quite possibly be relegated, setting in second last place, which is not good. Charlie Austin is currently on 16 goals, followed by Mbolo on uh, 15. So it's basically anyone's game. It's going to be well. One, this will be one of the crucial matches if we can pick up the three points. Depends who st scores could uh, determine the golden boot or even the the player of the season. But we are playing as Loftus, at Loftus Road, of course, against Bolton. Kick-off is underway, but we nearly go 1-0 down just before the 10th minute. Hessian was tested. Phillips makes it 1-0 just before the 24th minute. Like I said, he's got a pretty good growing goal-scoring tally, Phillips there. Chambers jumps on him, and we start off strong against Bolton. Really nice back pass there. Like I said, he scored 11 goals so far. 10, all right. Yuri, breaking away in the second half, manages to find Mbolo. He tries to finesse, but hits it over the bar. Pretty unfortunate. Mbolo hits it straight at the goalkeeper, remaining the scoreline 1-1. Yuri whips it in. A really nice header, rises to the occasion. Mbolo on the counter-attack, saved. Leroy Fier manages to make it 2-0 just before the 72nd minute. And I've got to give it to the Bolton goalkeeper. He was really doing quite well, holding off in Bolo there. Leroy Fier with a nice, quick action sort of drag shot there. 
But I'm going to end the video here. Thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe if you want and haven't already. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. All my social media links are in the description below if you want to stay connected to me. Stay tuned for more content on my channel. Have a fantastic rest of your day. Take care of yourselves. Make sure you take care of yourselves, guys. But, uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Stay tuned for more content on my channel.